¿Los ves? ¿Ves los aviones? Es un avión. Hola el avión. Dile hi. Miren. Dile hi. A ver. This is our first view. We kind of made it in quite late after we had picked up the car, had dinner, and still went grocery shopping. Just on time for the sunset. This kind of gives me a little bit of anxiety having him out here. So I'll pick up the camera in a bit. This is a little bit of a room tour. Uh, the room's kind of small. They said it was an upgrade than the one that they had. So I'm not sure how the other one looked. But there's like a mini kitchen and like a sink down over here. Don't mind the mess. We just got in like literally a few minutes ago. Okay, Lisa, Satan. Yeah, those are your diapers. Are you telling me you need a diaper change? Eh? You want me to change diaper? <laughs> City boy. Eh? Get these. Wow, a ver. Wow. ¿Dónde andas, Aiden? ¿Dónde andas? Gracias. Gracias. Hello guys and welcome back to another video. In today's video, we are actually not at home as you guys can tell by the beautiful scenery in the back. We came down to Hawaii for our anniversary and I'm looking in the window because I have a little Aiden there watching me. It's been a long day of traveling and it looks like it's going to start raining. We just checked into the hotel but it's been a very long day. We had a six and a half hour flight. Aiden has been to Hawaii before but he was a little bit smaller and I feel like because he's now walking it's a little bit harder to keep him entertained. Flashback. And a flashback. And all that good stuff. Mira. Aiden. Diles, me vine de vacaciones. Diles, me trajeron de vacaciones. Dile, ando de vacaciones con mamá y papá. We just checked in, like I mentioned. Um, it's kind of late. It's already seven, I think. Um, so we're not gonna do much today. So like I was saying, it was part of the plan to kind of just 
chill today regardless um but i thought we were gonna have a little bit more time getting the car rental took forever it was a nightmare it took us about an hour to get the car rental and then we went down to the food trucks near costco here in maui um we've been to maui two years ago maybe three um closer to three years ago and we kind of got the feel of it so we kind of went to the same places we went to last time don't look at my busted lip <laughs> aiden hit me on the plane ride oh. and it happened right when we landed so that is that is it for me huh Anda de travieso. Anda de travieso. Yeah. So we're going to go inside. Uh, I need to unpack and kind of get everything situated. We did stop at Walmart before we got to the hotel. So we can kind of grab a few snacks, drinks, and diapers for Aiden. I'm not sure what else we'll pick up the camera for today. If not, we'll see you guys tomorrow <laughs> next morning the elevators are here silly Aiden back from breakfast it is a little early um, Aiden kind of woke us up at 6 in the morning ready to go actually I think it was like a little bit right before like it was 6 which home time it was around 8 so I think that's why he was already ready to go here we are trying to get the day started um, today's gonna technically be our first full day here um, so we're trying to take it a little slow because yesterday was a traveling day and we made it in very late. So right now we went down for breakfast and we were out by the beach for like about an hour I think. The water looks super calm from up here. It's still a little chilly out there but I think it's because it's still very early. Get us agua? Yeah. We got some water at the hotel and I think he wants water. Get us agua? Yeah. Agua. Get us agua? Come agua. Agua. Like I mentioned, it's going to be a pretty chill day today, so we don't have much planned. Today's actually Eric's and I's seven year married anniversary which is uh, the reason why we usually travel out in September. But yeah, we're gonna go ahead and pick up the camera a little bit later. Not much to do today other than rest. And we do have dinner plans later on. We actually are going to the hotel we stayed at last time we were in Maui. Um, they have a steakhouse there and we really enjoyed it last time we were here. And I think we would enjoy it today and I wanted to take Aiden so they can so he can see kind of what we did last time as well 
So I'll pick up the camera a little bit later. Wow. Aiden? <laughs> wow! Ready to go. Yeah? Uh -huh. Ponte, 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 los. Wow! <laughs> We already went in the pool. <laughs> we just finished having lunch, and if you guys didn't watch our old vlog from Aoi, we went to this marketplace called Fish Market. And we had fish tacos there last time that were very good and we're not far from it So we decided to go there again and the tacos were good as we remember them We actually had coconut shrimp, which we've never had before and it was really really good Aiden is actually asleep inside right now, and I don't know if you guys can tell but The scenery looks a little bit different than my last check-in from the hotel. We actually ended up changing rooms um, last night was a whole different situation with the room I didn't even show you guys how like the sink area and the restroom area was and we weren't happy with the room the the room had a really bad odor and it's it looked dirty it looked like either it wasn't cleaned well or something was going on and Eric has very sensitive like he has a, I don't know, something's very sensitive where Eric can detect when there's mold because it's happened before and sure enough we found mold in the restroom and we stayed there yesterday we were going to change rooms last night but they were going to down they said it was an upgrade for the room but it wasn't an upgrade and they said we were going they were going to send somebody out to clean it today we were gone all morning nobody cleaned it during that time we came back and then that's when we found the mold so we just didn't want to be there anymore they were going to place us in another room inside of the hotel because the hotel has uh, 12 floors and it's quite big but i just felt like the problem was inside of the hotel not like the room itself because we saw a total we've seen a total of three rooms in the time that we've been here and the smell was all over the, the building like once you leave like the front desk i feel like you get the smell and yesterday they tried to kind of just put like an aroma um, cube in the vents which Eric took a picture of them today and like there's black stuff in there so I just feel like it wasn't maybe the hotel is just outdated it does look like they're going through remodeling so maybe it will get fixed later but a lot of the reviews that Eric said is that people were complaining of the smell when I booked through Costco none of their reviews were bad so that kind of makes me question the situation um so we ended up getting a new room this is considered a bungalow um, it's kind of on the side of the hotel i'll insert a quick picture here because you can see them from the view that we had they're like little houses um and we've already we've only been here for like probably 30 40 minutes since we got our food because we didn't do much other than bring our stuff down and here we are we went to go get dinner or lunch there's Eric I think he feels bad because we had to go do this whole move situation I feel like if so it, he could be I feel like if it was maybe like a motel 6 or something then I could understand but we're spending quite a bit of money to be here and for it to be moldy that's unacceptable in my opinion so feel like something had to be said and we're in a better place for sure because it does smell a lot cleaner inside I think like I said I think the situation is just the hotel itself because we are like be. this AC is not connected to anything other than I think four other rooms it's its own unit and yeah it's its own unit I mean there's tile instead of like carpet so I feel like just a lot of little things 
and we have Aiden with us so I feel like whatever is the healthiest situation and we just want to be comfortable like we said we just got in yesterday we were in the room for maybe about an hour then we left to get ice cream so like by the time we realized that it was getting late it was like 10 and we were gonna move last night but it just we didn't want to do the hassle of moving to another room that I felt was going to be the same situation. The refrigerator was smaller. We have a baby. He's drinking milk. So a two liter gallon in there. The refrigerator wasn't going to fit it. The TV was a lot smaller. And I know this is like all of the little stuff. But like Eric mentioned, when you do waste money on something, you just want to get the best quality of whatever it is. And we've been to many hotels before and we've never had a situation like this. So like it's kind of... We don't want to be those people either, but at the same time, it's like, it's our health as well. Because even Eric was saying, like, it's just not healthy for us to be here smelling that the whole entire time. And this is only day two, you know, so this is going to be our first full day here. We did spend, a, I think it was like a good hour. No, like two hours trying to figure out a new room situation and then having to move. It is now raining. Um, like I mentioned, today is our anniversary. And we have dinner at six. Aiden's taking a nap. I think he's still back in az time but we lost the view and it's okay um we're we're in a considered a garden view which is beautiful regardless because it's green and we don't have much greenery in arizona so i don't mind and then we have like a partial view of the ocean in front of us so i'll show you guys a quick room tour before aiden wakes up the room is definitely a lot bigger than the room we were in and it's a lot cleaner and it just smells like not even smells clean like you can just breathe that's what eric kept coming at because he was saying that he couldn't breathe in the other room like he felt like suffocated and they told their solution was just open the windows or like the sliding door and we'll put that like aroma in the room so it just kind of sucks because this is our first experience and we just got here but let i hope that this is not going to be how the trip's going to go and everything's gonna get better but I'll let you guys go for now I'm gonna show you guys a quick new room tour and then we'll probably see you guys at dinner time morning guys today is a new day and it is gonna be the end of today's video in this video you guys pretty much got our traveling day and our anniversary day last night we didn't do much other than go have a dinner but we are actually heading out now so if you guys do want to watch what we're gonna be doing today don't forget to tune into the next video that will be posted but this is it for now and we'll see you guys all in the next video So low, so low, so low.